Ready? Yeah. <laughs> I can't tell. <laughs> I recruited all my friends to come help me sand the outside of the bus in a couple days. So now what I have to do is make sure that it's ready for them. Mostly, which means getting all the sticky gooey stuff off the sides where the stickers were. So I have this stuff and this thingy. It says it's supposed to remove rust and paint from metal and other surfaces, but it seems a little too scratchy. I don't know if it'll just like bash up the metal. Or is it even metal or is it fiberglass? What even is fiberglass? Okay, don't really know what I'm doing here. This seems wrong. Well, this is working, but it also seems like it's going to take about as long as getting the stickers themselves off did, so. <laughs> Going really slow. It's like so gummy, so goopy, that it, it almost feels like I'm just spreading it around. So I'm wondering if I should maybe get the heat gun back out and try to scrape off the bulk of this because there's still so much goo left on here. I want to see if I can scrape off mo most of it before I start grind or drilling. What do you call this? Wire brushing off the rest? so long. I only have today to do this because my friends are coming tomorrow to help me sand and it's already noon and I've gotten like one thing done. So I'm going to Home Depot to get some different products. Okay so I was planning to get lacquer thinner but that's mostly just acetone which is what I was already using. So instead I got some paint stripper and I have no idea if this even works but I'm gonna try it. Oh good, it's gooey. I'm just gonna paint it on everything because I don't really care what happens to the paint underneath since I'm gonna repaint over it. So hopefully this is stronger and will work better. Dissolving my paintbrush. <laughs> I guess I can't seem to grasp. <laughs> 
my paintbrush. Okay, I feel like I've got a pretty good system worked out. So I'm taking my paint stripper. I'm almost out. Wiping it on with this rag, which doesn't seem to be disintegrating. Um, and I'm doing like a pretty small section, like that much at once because I don't know, all the stuff, all the videos I was watching, none of them used paint stripper, but they were leaving whatever product they were using on to sit for a few minutes, but it kind of seems like it's just like kind of evaporating and not really working if you, if you let it sit. So I'm going at it right away, just scraping. It's like a rubber cement ball. And... And then it ends up pretty clean. So I don't know if I'll have to do like, <laughs> go over it again with something, but my goal is just to get it clean enough that we can sand it without it gumming up all the sandpaper tomorrow. So I think I'm on track here. Hopefully it doesn't take too much paint thinner because it's not that cheap. I mean, it's cheap if you have the income of a, any normal adult, but I do not. from here back I need to do again from here it might be fine what do you think it did seem really sticky over that one definitely just needs another right here it's really sticky yeah. have you done the whole other side of the bus already yeah I nice. just did the whole entire bus with the paint stripper in about the same amount of time as I did just this section here with the drill and way less effort um it's still kind of sticky on most parts so I'm gonna just try giving it a test sand and see if it is gonna mess it up. And if so, then I'm gonna have to either just go over it all again and scrape it really good, maybe use a smaller scraper, or maybe I think get some steel wool or something to try to scrub it. Okay, so I tested this out, sanding it on parts like this where it's still pretty sticky. It got pretty gummy like this. So I think I definitely need to get some more off of there. Um, whereas down here where there was no adhesive, it was super easy. So I think it's worth like getting all this gummy stuff off to make just the sanding that much easier tomorrow. Okay, I'm going back on what I said before. After seeing how like over there where it dripped down and I left it sitting the whole time and the paint just bubbled off, I'm gonna let this sit for a while.
Okay, so what I'm doing now has just been to scrape with the scraper just more. I'm doing exactly the same thing as I was doing before, just a little bit more meticulously and checking after to make sure it's not too sticky. Okay, I finished at least enough to be ready for tomorrow. I'm so tired. I'm probably gonna regret this later, but I'm about to try to get this metal panel thingy out. Hopefully it'll just motivate me to figure out the windows sooner. Okay, I don't know how to do this. Okay, so yesterday I got some help and managed to get this thingy off, only to realize that all the little trim pieces, like these things that I was hoping to expose so that I could sand them, are gone. So there's no point in removing that, and now I have a gaping hole in my bus. But we got a lot done yesterday. A bunch of people came over and helped me, and we got the whole thing sanded. Gosh, we're famous now. I'm so happy. <laughs> and it looks really good. And I'm really excited to paint now. They only stayed for like an hour or two and we got kind of distracted at the end and stopped sanding. Anyways. So I will need to do some like touch-ups and finish some spaces, but they got a lot done, so I'm really glad. The paint stripper, I don't remember if I said this, it worked really well. The best thing was when I put a coat on, let it sit for a while, and then when I was scraping it off, whenever wherever it was like kind of dry or not coming off, just slap another coat on right on top of it, and it came off so easily. So I'm really glad I didn't waste my time with like Goo Gone or WD-40 or the other stuff that people have used. I have though, ever since the day I was taking the goo off, I've not been able to use a fingerprint reader. My phone doesn't recognize my fingerprints anymore, so I don't know if I destroyed them. It's kind of a bummer, but maybe I will pursue a life of crime now. Um, yeah, so next up is not paint. I wish it was paint. Actually, I have no idea what's next. <laughs>